y'all it's me rachel aka the glam queen and i am back with another video now in this video i am going to be showcasing um the items that i get from the well the shadows and blushes now this is shocking blushes from the coastal scents uh 99 cent hot pot sale so this is my um palette already and as you can see i just have a variation of browns because this is basically like my crease palette i need this palette to build creases i have one just like this in my kit and then this is my personal one but this, i use all these browns to create a bomb ass crease that's the only thing i can say so this big box came so cute do y'all see the pink and then it almost looks like a present so so cute coastal sense really knows you know their packaging i love makeup so cute i have one of those on something but i definitely use those So right here, I did get some palettes. Y'all, I'll be back. This is my mom called me. Okay, y'all. Sorry about that, but I'm back. So I did get six blushes. Now, this is new to me. I did not know that they were offering blushes now, but this is the blush palette. Now, I see that the plastic, I guess, is making it not show up correctly. So if you can see it. Hopefully you can. Now I have a lot of single shadows from just over the years buying. Um, what are those palettes that they... I forgot some of the palettes that they used to offer. That's when YouTubers were big. Um, you know, reviewing Coastal Scents products now. Not so much. So that's why I want to do this. Because Coastal Scents is still popping. They are still here. So I don't sleep on them. So I just got four of these. I think this is 12 pan shadows because right now I'm having I'm using the MAC shadows and yeah now I might be giving away I might be doing a giveaway of some use and I'm saying use but I will thoroughly clean them MAC um the palettes the empty palettes no filled in there I just ordered the palettes when I was first starting out as a makeup artist So, of course, it's bubble prep. I'll talk about that later. Sorry. But, um, this is bubble wrap, which, you know, is perfect. And so, these are all my products. Now, I did get double the eyeshadows because, like I said, I do get one for me and then one for my kid. But I'm first going to jump into these blushes, which I'm most excited about. I do wear blush. Um... And I know, you know, some people do, some people don't, you know, but I do wear blush. For the most part, I did try to get matte colors now. Yeah, and so far, I'm, I'm liking my shade. So, first thing first is Invigorate. It looks just like this. So, um, yeah, I'm liking this color. Not all the way orange. So, a good little mix of orange, brown. Okay. Now, this is obvious a contour color. And this is in bronze matage. And I hate, I'm thinking that this plastic is the reason why it's showing like that up on the camera. So, yeah, I think this will be, yeah. Ooh, thank you for coming out. So, now you can see like the size of the pan as well. Do a little swatch. They feel really soft. You no, know, I don't know. It might be, might not be a good console for me because this that's not even showing up on my hand. So mm, let's try another one because hey, we do want to know if they're pigmented or not. Anybody can come up with some, but we want to make sure it's pigmented enough. Okay. Again, not all the way, but just gonna show you those on my finger. Now this is the orange looks pretty and this is the brown so 
that brown i'm not too much impressed with so this is a plum color to me in the middle of a pink a purple and i don't really like i only have like a pink or burgundy so i don't really have like this plum color but go ahead and swatch this one too i don't know i'm not feeling like these are really pigmented but I don't know so this is definitely a purple blush this would have been perfect with what I have going on today so now this one I was about to say does seem pigmented sorry about that y'all that is my phone this one I know that this is not going to be like a blush blush color but I did like it sometimes just to uh you could just use it just to blend in the highlight contour and all that to make it as one this is another color this is like peachy tones and this is afterglow and so it does have some it's like this peach so yeah these swatches are not so lit. Um, sorry, y'all gotta get me a baby wipe. But yeah, those swatches, I'm not really impressed with. Um, but I'm not just going to talk about them because I do, I don't really, I always tone down my blush anyway. So I'm not mad. But I am just going to go ahead and put them in the palette really quickly so you know we can all see how they look fit perfectly I think this was a good look for them to come out with blushes now they did have other colors these are just the ones that I came up with and I mean I honestly like my blush palette uh this is me these are the colors that i would do so um yeah i like it i really like this and it's good enough to fit in my small enough to keep in my kit um i don't really like big big stuff so if i don't use those then i'll just well if i personally don't use them i'll just put them in my kit that's what i'm trying to say again and y'all please excuse me i wanted to unbox with you guys and i didn't want to waste time you know choosing the same colors well keep picking up the same colors so i did uh take some time out just to go ahead and um double them up so that i'm not doing that so let's go ahead and jump into these eyeshadows so first thing that i just randomly picked and i'm just holding up two at a time here is the meanest gold it looks just like this now i know y'all like that's not neutral or what i did was basically i got um mostly matte shades i think i have one that's not so matte um uh, matte but yeah i mostly just got matte shades and i just like this because you can build this in the crease as well so my favorite shade of them all is oktoberfest now if you don't know about oktoberfest fest it's like this brick red brown um, really really pretty looks good in everyone's crease I have it in my crease now amongst so many other browns that were in that kit I mean in that palette that I made this is pumpkin pie um this is a perfect color to either use on the lid like how I have this shimmery color on the lid you can use pumpkin pie for the lid or right underneath the brow bone Next is this oatmeal tan and oatmeal tan um, is so beautiful. Another color that you can build within the crease. Next is burnt umber and it is a deep, deep brown. I need this deep, deep brown. Um, a lot of people do that to do cut creases. Bronze peach, pretty. You can do this to again build in the crease. Okay, I was like, what? This is timeless tote, which I think I already have. There we go. Pretty. 
this is like an eggplant uh purple which i do not have uh kind of matches my lip or the liner that i use really pretty i don't really do a lot of purple and it's called maroon berry we're gonna get this to focus swatch it since it doesn't want to focus I'm going to swatch it for you guys and I'm going to dig my finger up in there to really get a swatch because I want y'all they're usually I think $198 regardless I will pay $2 for these because they're really good and this is beautiful this is the swatch beautiful y'all beautiful And I'm coming down to my last three shades. And so I have um, Midnight Rodeo, which is browns. It's a lighter brown. But it's like a bronzy. I don't know. It has kind of like some shimmers in there. Like I said, I did get like one kind of shimmer. I would do that on the lid. And this is Olive Wood. Now, I was really happy to get this. So you can kind of see it just an olive tone i honestly would have did this in my crease today since i have on this jacket but i'm going to dig my finger up in there oh yes it's green do y'all see that now it's not showing up good on the swatch but it is a green i'm, I'm i like this and last but not least we do have petal peach which you can do this on the lid or the brow bone just depending on what you're going for like if i'm going for all like peachy or um orange look i would probably pop that right into that brow bone so yeah so i'm going to be back to talk about my giveaway and i know y'all like this is a coastal sense video why would you be giving away a mac palette well the reason why i want to do a mac palette is because that is my old um palette that i use for my kit and so now since i'm using these palettes it's like i don't need all those palettes and i definitely want to uh do a giveaway for all of my new subscribers and my old that have been with me for so long so i'm actually going to give away two and i'll be hey like y'all i'm back so i had to get together my giveaway so I'm just going to go ahead and jump into it. So this is the palette that I will be giving away. It is authentic. It is a MAC palette. Looks just like this. Now, the reason why it looks wet and all that, because I have cleaned these out. And I've also uh, sprayed Lysol. I mean, it's not Lysol. Alcohol. I use this in my kit to sanitize and um, clean surfaces and all that and this and the other so it has been thoroughly clean so i'll be giving away four mac palettes okay so it'll be four winners for the mac palettes and it will have eyeshadows in those palettes so i'm going to quickly go through these eyeshadows so we have this one first and all of the palettes have been used, like I already stated, but that's why I cleaned them with the alcohol and soap and water and all that jazz. The shadows have been uh, slightly used as well. I really didn't use these shadows, so they're practically new. Like I said, I just depotted a lot of those old Coastal Scents um, palettes and i just put them in there but i don't use them so i'm just showing you really quickly the color not really trying to discuss them that much just want you to kind of see the colors so i talked so much about brown so i did want to include some browns now do not mind the color that's on the back when you do get it i just had to um <laughs> put it in something because i think these will be best to um ship um these how many do i have that doesn't have this it's six so the six will just be in whichever palette you get so i'm just letting one person know now since i do have 33 shades let's go ahead and do this right now 33 divided by four everyone will get 
It says 8.25, so I guess one person might get 8, 9, something like that. But for the most part, everybody have at least 8 shades. You will have at least 8 shades. So I hope that will definitely get you started in your makeup collection or your makeup um, kit. If you're a makeup artist, becoming makeup artist, all that. So moving right along, just going through really quickly, not trying to discuss it. I just wanted to let you guys know that it will be coming in these containers because this was perfect. Because I was trying to figure out how was I going to do this. And just going through my kit, I just realized I have so many shades. Like, Rachel, you don't use this. You don't use this. Or you got something like this. And like I want to say, this is slightly used. Slightly used. But I just want to do something for you guys to show how appreciative I am and how thankful I am. And how, you know, the likes, the comments do not go unnoticed. And I do have another giveaway coming up. AliExpress, eBay, but that will be later on down the road. Brown, brown. This little white shimmery brown. Okay, so done with the shades. So, like I said, somebody would at least get eight of these. At least eight. You will at least get eight plus your palette if you are the winner. And the last winner will just receive one empty palette just like this. Um, I'm hoping that you have some shades. I thought that this would be nice just to, because I think, a lot of people need these empty palettes. So, I just wanted to give one of those away. So, again, there will be five winners. One will receive this, just an empty Coastal Scents palette. The other four will receive MAC empty palettes and will receive at least eight shades to go along with those palettes. So, I will be putting these in here with your palette as well. So, um, all the details will be in the description bar. I don't know when this video will be going up, so that's why I'll just leave all the information in the description bar so you will have a deadline, a time frame, what everything you'll have to do. And yeah, so I hope you guys do win. <laughs> Five lucky winners. I wish you the best of luck. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to please subscribe. Please click that bell to get notified every time I upload a new video. Please be sure to follow me on Instagram, on Snapchat, and as well on Twitter. And I will definitely see you guys in my next video.